Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sports Night News. I'm Dvorak, and this is going to be the latest edition of the Royal Take as we recap some of the Royals' latest transactions. As our Reading Royals uh, ended up trading David Drake to the Wheeling Nailers, um, I was not able um, to get a response from Dylan from the text message I sent if that was just for future considerations, assuming it was, as they also made a trade of their own trading future considerations for rookie forward Anthony Gagnon um, earlier in the week as well. Um, back um, before the holiday, not earlier in the week, back before the holiday on the 21st, they were able to get Anthony Gagnon, who played in the Quebec Major Junior Hockey League from 15 to 20, um, where in 275 games, in the queue, he scored 61 goals and registered 70 apples to go along with that. So, Anthony Gagnon has been very solid I'm in his young professional career. And in his first season of professional hockey, he has recorded 9 points in 25 games uh, with the Admirals, scored 5 goals, and had 4 assists, and looked solid um, watching him on, well, it's not really CHL TV anymore, but on Flow Hockey uh, TV as well as playing against our very own Reading Royals, but he's a good rookie addition. This team already has some good rookies, Jackson Cressy, Cam Strong, so it's good to add in more rookies. It's good to be sad to see David Drake go as he now moves on as we wish him all the best success with the Wheeling Nailers, so it's sad to see him move on, but another great addition as another welcome comebacker, just like Trevor Gooch, uh, we have another guy coming back in Garrett Cockrell, who was signed on the 27th, and immediately, um, unfortunately, uh, placed on the injured reserve list, so we're going to have to wait for him uh, to come back, but he has not played it this season, but he did spend uh, the 2021 and 2020 and 21 season, excuse me, with the Tulsa Oilers, scoring seven goals and 27 assists in 59 games. Uh, he played for the Royals, of course. Uh, they acquired him from the Iceman back in 19, and he played in the 18-19 season and 19-20 season um, for the Reading Royals. So he is back, and in total, uh, he has scored 19 goals and 69 assists in 185 ECHL games, which, of course, totals 88 points. Uh, he will wear number 19 as he first did. And in other moves, Karo Usti Ustamenko was added to the taxi squad. As, of course, the taxi squads were reinstituted until the All-Star break in the NHL, for those that do not know. And then also Jacob Pritchard, who obviously was playing fantastic, having his breakout ECHL season, now has a professional tryout at the AHL level. Just like Nick Master from Danny Bray's May Mariners got a professional tryout with the Phantom. Uh, we saw him then end up going back down, so we'll see if Pritch ends up uh, wanting, to, or and they end up wanting to hang on to Pritch, excuse me, at the AHL level, as obviously he would want to stay up there. As congratulations, claps up to Jacob Pritchard. That's a big loss for the Royals, but a huge gain for the Rochester Americans, as we wish him all the success up there in the AHL. But this has just been a quick Royal Take edition as we go over the team acquiring Garrett Cockerell and also acquiring Anthony G Gagnon. Prior to the break for future considerations, trading David Drake to the Wheeling Nailers, which from what I can understand, I think it's for future considerations. Haven't seen any different players put on the roster. I haven't got a response yet on uh, if it's anything different. If it is, I will do a video on that. Ustamenko is up on the taxi squad. Jacob Pritchard is with the Rochester Americans on a professional tryout. Everybody have a great, safe, and pleasant day. Hopefully... The Royals games are able to stay on track this week, and we're able to play Anirondack, and we're able to play Worcester, actually, on New Year's Eve. Have a great day, and day with the, everybody. Enjoy the hockey. Enjoy the World Juniors. And please continue to subscribe down below to show your love and support. Really appreciate you for it. Peace out, everybody, and stay safe.